time again that I show you my few of my favorite things. It's Jess from She's the Posh. Welcome back. And today we're going to be doing my monthly favorites for May. Guys, it's almost summertime. I make videos every Wednesday and Sunday, all design and fashion related. I love sharing with you all my tips and tricks. If that is something you're into, please remember to hit subscribe below and ring my bell so we can become best friends here on the internet. Hey guys, it is the start of a new month, so I'm going to go over what I was loving for May. I like to do these in five categories, beauty, accessories, clothing, shoes, and a handbag. So first, we're going to start out with beauty, and your girl is always doing stuff to help protect her skin. If you saw from my vlog, I did the 24 karat facial, and I'm not about aging fast. I'm all about aging very slow as much as I can, and something that ages us really fast is the sun and not protecting your face. So I always have some kind of SPF, especially this time of year. So I got this Fenty. I was looking for a new one that was like lighter. Fenty Skin. I got this. There was some kind of sale going on with Fenty. So I ended up getting this for a discount. Thought it was worth trying. And this is their SPF 30 and I love it. First of all, it smells amazing and it's very light. And I love that it just kind of spins up like this and then you can refill it. So like then after you spend, I think this is around $39, $36, but after you spend that, all you have to do is buy the refill and it just pops right in there and it closes up like this. It's a pump bottle like that. Oh, it smells so good. Pump bottle and like that. So first of all, it's fun. It's like a little toy but it's practical and good for the environment. So yeah, I love Fenty products. It's one of my favorite beauty brands. I'm actually wearing Fenty lip gloss, love the lipstick, their makeup. It's just very well-made, long-lasting, great products, and they're not crazy expensive. I really love and appreciate Fenty. Next, we're gonna talk accessories. And one of my favorite accessories during this time of year are sunglasses. Like if you saw from my sunglasses collection, I really should do an updated sunglass collection because it has grown since then. It has grown. But I have been loving these right here. These are like such a statement. My Fenty, F is for Fenty cat eye. They're kind of like a dramatic, extreme cat eye sunny. And they're just so much fun to wear. Like you kind of get a personality with it. Oh, you know, and then you put these on, you're like, mm-hmm. What did you say? Huh? Who? Me? You kind of get a personality with it. And they look great in like all my pictures. I always get so many compliments on it. And I actually did a reel and all I did was basically, I was wearing these sunglasses and then I would just like, I was talking, saying stuff and putting it down and sliding it up. And it got like over 20,000 views for this reel. And I'm just like, oh, oh, okay. I think it was the sunnies. I really feel like the sunnies were making it. So these ones are currently on sale, I believe, for around $270. They were on Bloomingdale's and things like that. So I'm going to link you some sales pieces. They usually retail for close to $400, but you can definitely find them under three on all the sales. Get yourself some Rakuten, get yourself a sale. But yeah, if you were thinking about getting these, you should just go for it because it's just like the personality and the compliments you get with it totally worth it. Next, we're going to talk clothing. And you saw from my last video, I have merch that I created and I have literally been wearing my sweatshirt. So I have two different sweatshirts with the different sayings, which is this one. She's the posh. This one on the back says, I want to age like a Louis Vuitton. So this one, I've been wearing it. Also, my other one that says, I got my chic together. I really love these sweatshirts. They're super soft and cozy. And every morning, like when I wake up, before I get dressed and ready, or before I do my yoga, I have my leggings on and things like that. I've been throwing on these hoodies because it's been chilly in the morning, especially this time of year. I drink my coffee. I love to be outside as much as possible. 
Hence the SPF that I have to be wearing. I'm just really proud of it. I love it. The links are down below. Thank you guys for the kind words and compliments that you had on my merch. I'm thinking about doing a giveaway. Like if you think I should do like a merch giveaway type of thing, let me know in the comments down below because I am thinking about doing something fun for you guys because I love you. Next, we're gonna go with shoes. And these ones have been in my favorites before. It's no surprise, probably be in my favorites for next month as well. And that is the Chanel Dad Sandals. And this is in the, the basket material with the pearls. That's the raffia material here. And as you can see, there is some wear to it because I literally wear these like several times a week, almost every day, super comfy. Even this material, people have asked me if it's comfortable. Well, the inside, everything is leather lined. So inside of this is all leather. So when you're in here, your foot, everything is soft, cozy leather. It's not like your foot is ever really touching this basket material on the outside. But as you can tell, places where your foot will rub against the other foot or just walking, stuff like that, you will have some of that come up. However, it doesn't bother me. I think it just kind of adds to the look because you know that's gonna happen. I haven't lost any pearls. That was the one thing I was worried about is what if, you know, what if I lose a pearl, but that has not happened yet. So I, I'm thinking about just maybe taking a little bit of scissors and trimming this part right here as the basket stuff comes up, just to make it look a little nicer, a little cleaner. But other than that, I really love these. I think these ones are more obtainable than any of the other dad sandals. But if you were like thinking about getting dad sandals, you weren't sure if you'd wear them enough, you weren't sure if they're comfortable, fear not because they are super comfortable. You definitely can find them at retail, but you just have to follow. I had the best luck with a Saks Fifth Avenue associate. So I'll make sure to have her link down below because she gets these in stock every once in a while. So if you want to have these and let her know that they are on your radar. You can go ahead and message her on there. But yes, love, love turning into my dad. Whoever thought turning into my dad would be so chic. And the last category is handbags. And for this month, I gotta give it to my fanny packs. The bum bags have been awesome. It's, it's the hands-free lifestyle for me. I do love having a backpack. I do have backpacks. I have been using those as well. But I think this one is for the win. This is one I love the most. This one I usually wear just when I have more things and it's not raining, I wear this one right across my chest. And this one is like very minimalist. I got all the essential things I need. I just throw this on my waist. I go to the zoo, I go to the park, I do whatever. I am hands-free. I can grab my toddler, drink my latte and look fabulous. So yeah, guys, I love bum bags and fanny packs. So this one has gone up in the price increase. I believe this one now is, but it's still under $2,000. So this is around, I think, $1,790. Of course, you'll have tax added to that. I will have my essays linked down below. She works at Bloomingdale's and she usually gets one of these in stock a month. So if it's something you're interested in, like you can message her, but I recommend it because I think for the price, which is awful to say that canvas bags under 2000 is a great price, but it is true. Like you saw, if you didn't from one of my last videos, I got LV utility bag. Absolutely love that bag. But that bag is, it's crazy price. It is almost double the price of this bag. I bought this bag before the price increase. So this one I got when I purchased it right around $1,600 that I was able to get this one for. But my utility pouch was over $3,000 for that bag. Let me show you the difference. Here's my utility pouch. Like look at the difference. This can hold so much more. It's versatile. I love this bag, it's gorgeous, but it is a mini bag, whereas this bag is just so practical. You have this big zipper on the back, which I put my phone and stuff in there. Big zipper here to get all of your stuff, everything you need, zip it up, throw it on your chest, call it a day. You can grab everything easily while it's on. You can swing it around to your back. I just love this. And I think for the price of this bag, it is just, great affordable price point for an LV canvas bag because Louis Vuitton is that they're gonna keep doing price increases. These pieces are gonna keep getting crazy expensive. So if you want it, you should just get it now because even on the secondhand market, these bags right here are going for over $2,000 secondhand market and they're not brand new. I just don't understand what the prices are doing now. And this bag being over $3,000, I just think it's highway robbery. Yes, it's a great bag. Yes, I love it. Yes, I use it all the time but the price was terrible and it's just making me sad because not that I'm getting priced out of Louis Vuitton, but in a way I am because I just, if I'm gonna spend my money, I want the value 
for the price to be there. And I feel like that is going to be starting to change. So yeah, guys, definitely recommend getting yourself a bum bag. Okay, guys, that is everything. Let me know what you were loving for May. What are you stocking up for summer? I would love to know in the comments down below. And as always, I want to thank you so much for watching and hope to see you again. Bye, guys.